Hey, what's up everybody? My name's Joey Corbin. This is my girlfriend Amber, and today we are going to review the Alienware Alpha. This console, this computer console thing is pretty awesome, so I want to talk about it and tell you guys all the good and bad things about this console. Um, now, before we start the review, let's first talk about something else, and I want to talk about this because she thinks that you guys don't like her being in the videos, that you guys don't want her, that you'd rather just see me, and I want to know, do you guys like seeing her in the videos? Because I want her to be a part of this channel. She's like me. She has tons of anxiety, and she's really shy, so she doesn't have a job or anything to do during the day so I want to give her something to do like I have to do and I want her to be a part of this channel so she can have this to do and we can do it together it'd be fun um, so let me know if you guys like seeing her in the video and if you think it's a good idea of her being on this channel I think it's awesome because it gives me somebody you know to be in the videos with me to play games with for the streaming um, for the live stream when I start doing that which I do have another person shout out to Dakota Harris because he's gonna be playing with me as well but anyways, enough talk about that stuff. Let's talk about what we're here to talk about, and that is the Alienware Alpha. Now, first thing I have to say about this console slash computer is do not get the cheapest one. This is the $476, I believe, one on, um, on Amazon. That's how much it costs. I got it for $450 at Walmart. Do not get this. This has 4 gigabytes of RAM. Everything else is perfect for this. Um, everything else about this is perfect but the four gigabytes of RAM is too slow to run Call of Duty it lags so much and it can't even find online games now every other game works pretty well with this system but sometimes they will lag as well and run slow also when you open up the apps and you go to you know play any games they load they don't they take a little while to load they take a little bit more than I would want them to take now what do you think about the Alienware you said you like it, but you don't like using the keyboard. It's okay, but I don't use keyboards, and the controller is the best thing to use. Yeah, and I agree. Keep there you go. Keyboards and controllers. So there you go. Okay. That was, <laughs> thank you, Amber. Um, so there I go. Um, yeah, I agree. I, you know, I had to get used to the keyboard. I actually like the keyboard and mouse more now because for shooters, it just seems much easier to, you know put where you're going to put your gun, you know, your little gun um, scope at. It's easier to control. It's like wherever the mouse is, that's where the scope of the gun is. And it's easier to shoot um, people like that. Um, that sounds bad. Uh, but we're talking about video games here, people, not real life. Um, but yeah, the keyboard... Let me talk about the keyboard. Um, most games on the Alienware Alpha has to have a keyboard and mouse. So I thought that, you know, they should have, you know, came with the keyboard. So I had to go out and buy a keyboard and mouse. Where's my mouse? Where's my mouse? I lost my mouse! Oh my god! It's right here. <gasps> I found it. It's okay. It's <laughs> it okay, not, Joey. It's it okay. so close to not being okay. <laughs> yes. okay? okay? It's okay. It's not okay. Okay. Went out and got a gaming keyboard and mouse for only 30 bucks. This was on a sale, actually. It was 70 but um, I, I got blue because my channel is pretty much blue. If you see the banner, it's always blue, and everything I do for check out my pops is usually blue. So I'm gonna do blue on everything. Controllers are gonna be well, my controller is black actually, but um, my headphones, my microphone is all gonna be blue. You guys will see what I'm talking about when I stream. But anyways, back to the alpha. Enough talk. I'm getting sidetracked here. That's my ADHD. Um, yeah, I went out and bought a gaming keyboard because most of the games use a keyboard and mouse and I mean yes I found some games like the next car game that is supposedly only for keyboard and mouse it actually works with the Xbox controller and it works well except for you do have to push the E and the R button to restart and make your car you know fix to fix your car all right but yeah the Alienware Alpha is such a great system I have to say it's definitely the best choice for a person who's trying to get into PC gaming this is the best one the best thing you could get um, now I was disappointed when I found out the cheapest one wasn't really that good for running you know games fast or for being fast because Alienware Alienware itself is supposed to be for gaming so I was a little confused about that but I think um, you know if you do get the 8 gigabyte one everything will be perfect now I'm talking about 8 gigabytes of RAM I'm not talking about 8 gigabytes of hard drive memory space um, what was your favorite game to play on the Alienware Alpha and you cannot say Gmod because you have have not played that yet. <laughs> Gmod works I... great. Um, 
you played Super Meat Boy. You played, um, come on, there was one more game you played. I believe there was a game that we played together. Goat Simulator. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that game's awesome. And it works great as well. All the other games except for Call of Duty work pretty good. I mean, I had a little bit of trouble, and it was once in a while with, uh, had a little bit of trouble with Payday 2. Um, but yeah, every other game works really good. Um, so I assume with the eight gigabytes, every game's gonna work like you know, just that's gonna be just like that with the speed, and it's gonna work perfect. So if you're going to get one, get the five hundred and twenty-nine dollar one on the Amazon. That's it's only like what seventy bucks more, or I don't really know how much that's more. That's a lot of money. Okay, you're talking about a PC that you're gonna be using yeah. for the rest of your life. Would you rather pay seventy bucks more and have it work just perfect, or would you rather have spend uh, seventy bucks? Left and have a really crappy computer. I okay. agree with you now. Okay, now th that's what I'm talking about. So if you're going to get this computer, make sure you save up and get the $529 one. They also have other ones on there for like 700, 700 bucks, but don't get those ones. You can get one for $529, brand new, and it works just like the $700 one, I think. It's got, you know, 8 gigabytes of RAM, and it's got 1 terabyte of memory for the hard drive. So that's a lot of memory. I don't see why you would need more memory than that. I mean, how, how many games are you going to download? Um, this one ha only has 500 gigabytes of um, hard drive space, and I've already downloaded, like, 28 games, I believe. And, you know, it's running a little slow because I downloaded that many games, and it's all because of the 4 gigabytes of RAM. So if you get the 8 gigabytes, like I've been saying, if you get that much gigabytes of RAM, you'll be fine. Everything will work out just well. I've seen many reviews for this thing, and, in the, and they were the 8 gigabyte ones, and they have all good reviews. So definitely, if you're going to get this um, system, this console right here, go for the 8 gigabytes. You can't go wrong with the 8 gigabytes. Oh. Um, so what do you think of Goat Simulator? That's the funnest game in the whole wide world, and it's she really- She likes being the ghost. She says it's, it's cute. Fun. It's not cute. The ghost is not cute. That... It looks dumb. It's adorable, and it's smiling. It's adorable. She says pops are ugly. <laughs> no, <laughs> now, now everybody's gonna go crazy. Everybody's gonna be like, oh, no, no, she didn't, because everybody on this channel loves pops. She thinks some of them are cute, but she, she says they're not that cute. Um, I think they're adorable. Adorable? Just adorable. Adorable. They're cuter than you, yes. <gasps> I'm just kidding. Do you yes. hear that? Yes, I'm horrible. Everyone. She heard horrible. it. Horrible. Oh, horrible. Two. No, I joke Your around girlfriend. a lot with her. Um, now, let me talk about the Xbox 360 controller. Where is that at? The Xbox 360 controller, a brand new Xbox 360 controller, is given to you with the Alpha. Now, um, I think they should have used the Xbox One controller because it's the same but a little bit better. Also, it does come with this thing right here that plugs right into the front of it. Where's the front? Right into the front with the USB, um, and it, it just connects the 360 controller just like that. Um, it's really fast, and all you got to do is just press the little button on here and press the button on your controller, and it connects really well. So I think that's pretty cool that they, you know, that it works so well with the Alpha. But like I said, I think they should add a keyboard and mouse. You know, something simple. So they don't, it don't have to be expensive or anything like that. Just a cheap keyboard and mouse to get you started would be good. I mean, that's what I think would be, you know, nice to have with the Alpha. But um, the Goat Simulator is really fun. We played multiplayer on that uh, split screen, and it worked really well. She used the controller, I used the keyboard and mouse, and we had a lot of, you know, a lot of fun. No lag whatsoever. Yeah, so it was go awesome. ahead and tell them what you do, what do I in do? that game. To that poor family that's I, eating. They did not invite me to dinner that family, so I had to wreck their dinner table. You know, I had to tear it all up. Um, and they don't, if they don't invite me to dinner again, I'm gonna do the same thing in the stream. Everybody will see me wreck their dinner table. As I am part of their family. I'm their, I'm their goat. I'm their long lost goat. Um, but yeah. Um, also, I know about the tag video that you guys want me to do for that girl. She has an awesome channel. I don't know her name right this second. I don't know how to say it or pronounce it right this second. But I'm going to look into that on how to pronounce it. So I'm more professional. But um, yes, yeah, so I'm planning on doing that video. So uh, shout out to her, Miss Nameless Girl. And me. Shout out to her because she's awesome. She's got 800 subscribers. She's almost to a thousand. So you're doing awesome. You with the name that I cannot pronounce. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I said I'm bad. I'm so sorry that I can't pronounce your name, Miss Miss Nameless Girl. I am so sorry. Joey. I, I don't know her name. Okay, I'm gonna call her we'll Nameless do... Girl. I don't. I don't know what I say. Girl. Hey, Miss yes. Girl. Miss Girl. I'm sorry. No. It sounds mean if I say it like that. It Miss sounds... Girl. I'm. So don't know it sounds name. mean when you're saying it before that. 
I'm trying not to be mean. I'm trying to just just let her know that I think you're doing great with your channel. And I put you in my um, playlist so you get more views. I want to help you out. So hopefully you'd like to collab with me. If so, um, let me know if you play video games. Because I need people to play video games with. This is to everybody. If you play on Steam on a PC, let me know. And we might do some streaming together. But no cussing. No cussing. Because I don't do cussing. Now the games can cuss and all that. But that's, you know, that's, that's up to the people if they want to watch that. I don't cuss, but the games do sometimes. So it's up to the, the people who watch if they want to watch the mature rated game I leave that up to them but me myself I do not cuss on this channel um, also shout out to two epic kids TV um, I might be streaming with them soon on some games so they're pretty they're pretty awesome you you need to go check them out two epic um, kids TV two epic two epic kids yeah two epic kids TV is an awesome channel they do really good with everything they do and I'm so hoping to work with them also shout out to crazy Kurt I know I haven't worked with you in a little while but I do want to work with you again um, and that's the end of this video I just want to give out some shout outs also I'm being um, I'm working with a company called nesteduniverse.com and if you want to get three dollars off on your first purchase use the code COMP which stands for check out my pops. So those are the shout outs for now. Um, be sure to subscribe, click like if you enjoyed this video, and as always, thank you for watching. <laughs> Thanks again guys for watching this video, and before you leave, I just wanted to let you guys know that yes, this channel is mainly for Funko Pops, but it will also have other toys as well. So if you're a toy lover, toy collector, or just a kid who plays with toys, then be sure to subscribe to this channel.